one thing I'm noticing, not having ridden in a long time out here, the lanes, the paint needs to be repainted. The lanes aren't very clear and demarked. The sun is blazing. Lighten me up over here. Local rails were constructed originally for transporting equipment, materials, and construction of Boulder Dam, known today as Hoover Dam. The trains brought items to the railroad's buildings like the one in Boulder City. This branch rail line cut through the area that would become the city of Henderson. Today, the Union Pacific Railroad still runs through many neighborhoods over washes, trails, and directly into industrial complexes. Learn a little history here. morning my butt is tender I haven't done this in a while the butt is tender oh my gosh <sighs> hello What's up party people? Vegas Venture coming to you today from my home, Henderson, Nevada, at the top of Railroad Pass um, between, uh, basically this is the end of the Las Vegas Valley, about as south as you can go before you run into this open land and a little stretch between about five miles between here and Boulder City, which is around that hill over there. Um, today's ride is gonna be about what I guess we'll call Railroad Pass slash Upper Trail. Um, in preparing for this video, I was uh, doing a little research on the trail. I hadn't ridden it in a little while. I've ridden this trail many times. Um, I always thought it was called Railroad Trail or Railroad Pass Trail. Um, according to the trailheads, officially it's called the Union Pacific Railroad Trail. The city has it listed as the Upper Trail and even renamed the Harry Reid Upper Trail since Searchlight is just that way. Over the hill is Basic High School where he went that way. He was a very uh, influential senator here so i guess that's why they renamed it but nevertheless i'm not sure of the actual name basically i started near my home at the 215 the, which is called the 215 trail which parallels 215 and then it turns into this set of trails also this trail here as you can see there's a bridge right there we'll be taking that bridge that way back to henderson or back to where i live anyways we're in henderson um, but if you keep going that way over the hill it takes you it becomes what's called the river mountain loop is i believe the name and that will take you down to lake mead parkway down to lake las vegas and into the entrance of the park and it will parallel the west side of the lake and, and it ultimately will return you out this way um, to the allen bible uh, visitor center which is at the top of the hoover dam basically and you can take the hoover dam this way as well uh, it's probably another 15 miles um, today this trail is uh it's 11 miles each way so it's a relatively short uh ride um so i've already been 11 miles it's gonna be 11 miles back um as you saw i rode this way i'm going to uh try to see how fast i can get back because the cool thing about this trail it's a very entry level trail families can ride it and so forth um but whenever i ride um preferably if you get lucky enough i love it when if you're going to be returning to the same point that you um, have the hill on the way up or on the way out and that you have mostly downhill on the way back um, it's a drag when you gotta do it you know you start off with a downhill 
haven't even worked out and then you do nothing but working out on the way back so this trail if you're coming from the main part of henderson or main part of las vegas um it is it will be all healed this way it's very gradual it's only probably about a half a percent um to a percent grade um so i'm going to time it to see how long it takes and uh, let's see also show you on the map here what trail we're taking today and as you can see there it is and let's start the timer all right and here we go um, other than the next couple hundred yards is all downhill Ooh, get go. Here's the split to River Mountain Loop, I believe. That's what it's called. Uh, maybe part of the upper trail that goes to River Mountain Loop, I don't know. Railroad Pass, the way I'm going. And there's the beautiful of Las Vegas with a bunch of smog. All right, here we go. All down here from here. Another split there. Don't know where that goes. Never been that that way. These trails all interconnect. It's kind of a biking city in Henderson to some degree. Good trails, anyways. Roads, not so much. People will kill you here. Going the wrong way and ahead of us right here is nevada state college and um, today's the first time i've been up here in a couple years and this used to be if i recall just one or two buildings and then i remember when they put in this other kind of black building there turn my torso um but now i see they built dorms since i was last up here so the cool thing i mean the, unfortunately this area doesn't have a good university system all there is is unlv which is a good university and then Nevada State College, or uh, no, I said that wrong. This is Nevada State College. Um, College of Southern Nevada is what I'm trying to say. That's the whole university system historically. So they, this school has started really small, but I see now it's really growing. So I think it's kind of cool because it will give Henderson its own university. And look at all the land out here. I mean, this school, I can see this being a major, maybe a D1 school one day. There's so much land, you can put a stadium out here. It just sky's the limit, so I'm pretty ecstatic about that. Nevada definitely needs help in the education department because we have one of the lowest ratings of education in the nation. Or at least one of the lowest rating, lowest rating school systems. I think we're like 49th next to Mississippi.
Horizon. Thank you. Nice, kind people. Wait, I missed the trail. Ooh. You see these little railroad cogs? The whole thing is about the railroad. College. Oh wow, it's crazy. So this used to be, is this it? Yeah, it is because there's the mobile homes. This used to be the golf course. It used to be the Black Mountain Golf Course and for some reason the city decided to sell its soul to, well, we know the reason, money, corporations. And they came in and bought up this huge parcel of land and built all these houses. And I wonder who got the money. I wonder if the, city, the citizens of Henderson benefited at all. I don't remember getting a tax rebate. For those who are familiar with the city but may not know where I'm at, this way, pivot my body, is the old, on the other side of those houses is where Fiesta Casino used to be. Get down. And this is the 95 slash now new Interstate 11 as has been built going through Arizona to Kingman to 40. So it used to be called the 95, then it became the 515, now it's Interstate 11. That big mountain over there, that is French Mountain. I've climbed that, shoot, at least three times. I have a video on it. If you go out to my channel, main channel, you'll see I have a video on Mount Frenchman. Oh wow, oh, that's the upper trail now. That's new, okay, maybe that's, huh. Hmm, okay, I'm going to take a different route. Um, Cause I want to see where that goes. I'm pretty sure that probably, if I had to guess, probably goes over to Windmill. That's a, this, this section is new. And it does say upper trail right there. So again, it becomes more confusing as to what the trails are called anymore. Oh, far side, a oh, far ride, haha. -ha. But if you go this way, just over that hill, you can see a cyclist coming. Um, about eh, a quarter of a mile 
is Gibson Road. And um, up here is Horizon Ridge. There's Gibson, two joint. And uh, you can pick up this trail anywhere, almost all the way back to, I know it goes at least to Eastern. I think it goes at least another exit, which is probably Warm Springs, which is almost at, at the Strip, almost at Las Vegas Boulevard. So you can take this anywhere to get you that way to Railroad Pass. And there's our beautiful Black Mountain. So I was way off. It took me about 29 minutes to get here. Folks, that does it. I ended up coming to uh, the 215 trail is just up there on the other side of the bridge. This is a new wing of the trail. And I'm at Gibson and Windmill? Wigwam, sorry. Gibson and Wigwam, I should know this. I live, live around here. Um, anyway, nevertheless, you can take the trail here. You can take the trail up there. It all links up to, I guess they're calling this the upper trail now. I have no clue. Upper trail, railroad pass trail, uh, river mountain loop. Look that up if you have any questions. Just pull up Henderson Park trails. You will find it. And uh, if you want a nice leisurely trail, get a little cardio, maybe take your family on, this is the way to go. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe and peace.